To do what to do, I don't know, but we start hour two right now, uh, kicking it into high gear, talking about the big debate tonight, the great debate special coming to you live right here on uh, Biz TV. me and Kevin McCullough, along with a host of uh, America's greatest political minds will be here, Frank Morano, Aaron Elmore, uh, AJ Katz, Sky Ostreicher, uh, Carol Markowitz will be here, and uh, Kristen B. Tate along with John McLaughlin, Donald Trump's pollster, will all be joining us tonight throughout the night from 8 to midnight. You can catch it all right here on Biz TV. Don't go nowhere because we're going to give you the best debate coverage there is out there. Now, um, we just uh, talked about in the last segment with Gary Goldman how uh, there is still this outside possibility that uh, Joe Biden may not show up tonight for the debate. Um, and uh, a quick check by uh, Mike, part of my team here uh, on uh, one of the sports books out there, is that uh, Joe Biden is plus 250 to not show up. Um, that's not crazy odds, to be honest with you. So if you bet $100 that Joe Biden will not show up to debate tonight and he doesn't show up, you win $250. So the odds are like two and a half to one. Um, I would think in most debates, the odds of the other person not showing up would be like 10 to 1. Um, so they're a little lower here because even the bookies down in Vegas are saying, eh, it's not that far out of the question. And you could bring back 250 for every 100. Um, my bet is that he'll be there. Um, we're going to be keeping a close eye tonight throughout our coverage on uh, how many times Joe Biden's tugging on his ear or itching his ear or pushing his finger in his ear because uh, many are saying that he may have a, a microscopic uh, earpiece in so they could feed him some lines. I think, I'm going to be honest with you, I think the bar has been set so low for Joe Biden that if he stands up straight for an hour and a half and only has a few gaffes, the left-wing media is going to come out and proclaim that it was the greatest debate performance since John F. Kennedy or something. Um, and the bar is, can he even show up? Can he even stand for an hour and a half? Um, can he, you know, will he have diapers on? Will he be able to hold his, uh, himself together for an hour and a half? Will he be able to take the onslaught from Donald Trump, who gave a seriously decimating beating to uh, Hillary Clinton three times? It's all up for grabs, and we'll break it all down tonight, that's for sure. A um, little side note here, if you're in the New York area, we're at Angelina's Restaurante today, a beautiful restaurant right here on the water in Staten Island. One of, if not the finest Italian restaurant around. Um, beautiful outdoor scenery here. If you go outside, there's tables, there's bocce courts, they're right on the ocean. It's a wonderful setting. And um, we're going to do a little debate al fresco tonight um, where we'll sit outside and we'll watch the debate and we'll get your views. If you want to come on down, please feel free to come on down, join the party. We will have a great debate party tonight and we'll watch it all together. And we'll get your points of view and your take on what happened in tonight's first debate. And um, for those of you out there wondering, well, why is JT on in prime time? The network um, put in some heavy work. I've been telling you that Biz TV is getting bigger and bigger every day. And um, now they're approved by the uh, White House Press Corps to carry these things. And um, myself and Kevin McCullough have been tapped um, to talk about the political ramifications of the debate. And we're going to carry it here for you right on Biz TV. Uh, if you don't have the Biz TV app, go on your app store, download it. You can watch it for free there, or you can go to Biz tv.com and you can watch it live there as well we are going to kick off a wonderful second hour if you're a 1099 employee if you're an independent contractor if you're somebody who works for a bunch of different companies as a consultant you're under attack right now and we're going to break that down